Okay, let's get the rest of this keek over with. Here's the boss fight. We have to fight him. Yada yada yada. Okay, um... I had a big bother with this boss fight, actually, for some reason. Um, I've done them hundreds of times before, but... Don't worry, I used my magic editing stuff, and it should be a bit better now. Yeah, here comes Werehog Sonic trekking in the snow. Actually, yeah, these are essence. Yeah, these are essences of Dark Gaia. Because I was actually thinking there, how come every temple doesn't have like an essence of Dark Gaia protecting it? You think there would be? But there's no. So saw that right. What we gotta do here is there's a force field protecting them. So we've got to pick up these first. I'm collecting all the medals, but we have to take these conveniently placed. Uh, canisters of liquid nitrogen. I don't know what the fuck they're doing out here, but yeah, we gotta use those and Yeah, that happens <laughs> Actually it attacked us before uh, We could get away, so we're frozen and all but if we get out quick enough before our health goes away. Yep Yeah, I was sucking royally at this boss fight Bang, bang, bang. Okay. And we're up! But, I'm just gonna grab all the rings. The rings. The medals first. I keep calling... Why do I always call things what they're not actually called? I'm terrible like that. Right, and you're supposed... You can hit him any way you want, but... Mainly you're supposed to freeze him to do more massive damage. And that happened again. And I really struggled um, at the end here. You know, I got him a second time. You're supposed to hit him three times, of course, but... Ah, uh, just watch and you'll see. It was annoying. And those are the slowest moving bits of ice energy ever. Run, 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 run. Bang! Right, force field's down. We gotta go behind them now, but I didn't realize this right away. Because I decided to freeze them. Right, now we've got to, like, hit his head, but he does this annoying attack where he s slams his head down and spins it around, but he wouldn't do it, so I got annoyed and I decided to use some magic, which is gonna happen right now. And. Come on. There we go. Yeah, I got annoyed. I got really annoyed here. And I didn't want you guys to endure it also. Yeah, it just takes... I kept trying to, like, his last weak point's on his head. And he does this attack, you'll see it in a minute. He keeps doing that spray ice attack, which is annoying as fuck, and really hard to avoid if you're carrying a canister. But... So I kept freezing him, and I kept trying to hit the heat. Look, he does that thing where he slammed his head down, you see that? You're supposed to freeze him then, but he wouldn't do the friggin' attack! Like... Ages would go by and he wouldn't day. It was annoying as fuck. <laughs> Eventually, I figured out somehow you can, uh. You know, if his heat's down low enough, you can just grab it anyway, but it's annoying. <laughs> and my health was going down really low, and I was getting nervous because what's the fuck doing this again? Here's me thinking maybe I can still hit him in the back. I was, of course, incorrect. <laughs> oh, my word. Come on. There, now you can hit him. <laughs> and here comes the awesome fanfare again. No, not that. <laughs> I just love that epic jingle right there, it's awesome. Now we got to upgrade that there, life. And what's next? Should get a cut, some cutscenes, yeah. Which means I can be quiet and have a good reason for it. Yes! I'm 
mural. Actually, it does look a lot like Lost World, now that I think about it, from Sonic Adventure 1. Cyan Emerald. I think it's Cyan anyway. And now the continent of Alaska has been restored! I should really I just cut those friggin' loading times out. I really should have just cut this out as well. Why am I leaving this in? <laughs> anyway, we gotta head back to Spagoni, I imagine, and talk to Pickle for a wee bit. To inquire as to what to do next. And I'm pretty sure a cutscene's about to pop up. Not quite. One's coming soon though, I assure you. Right, is it night time or daytime? Daytime! We can't go fast at all. You can actually go faster with the Werehog than Sonic in these sections, I think I realised. Sonic? And we say random shit to him that we don't care about. Tells you to go to Shamar, also known as Arid Sands. And we are so good. Well, I'm handing over souvenirs first, and he's gonna tell us a bunch of shit. I really should have cut this bit out. Nobody gives a fuck about this. Okay, well. Yep, cutscene. Yeah, we're not supposed to ask how Robotnik did that. All systems are green. Dark Gaia this cutscene's pointless, actually. All you need to learn in it is that Robotnik somehow found a way to get all the Dark Gaia creatures to come to him, and that's it. It's all just filler. Yes, yes, perfect! Gathering Dark Gaia's pieces is such a pain! I'll have them come to me instead! A brilliant shift in perspective! An idea worthy of Dr. Eggman! Super genius! <laughs> Your skill at self-aggrandizement is unparalleled. <laughs> Silence! Activate the Dark Gaia Fusion Furnace! And while you're at it, get those energy conversion circuits warmed up. Understood. Commencing Project Dark Gaia. Requesting final clearance. Granted! <laughs> Finally, my ambitions will be achieved! <laughs> I just realized also, whenever, whenever Robotnik presses a button in any game, he always smacks it down for some reason. Must be really enthusiastic about it. Anyway, here we are in Shamar. Um, I had a bunch of I did a bunch of exploring here trying to find medals, but I decided to say fuck it and cut all that out because none of you would have gave a shit, and I don't like doing post commentary for too long. So, yeah. 
My god, I kept this loading screen in though. Yeah, here's what I did. <laughs> I forgot I actually just uh, sped it up rather than uh, cut it all out. I thought that's what I did. I guess, just for those of you that want to see where I got the medals, even though, okay, at that part right there, I was actually trying to see, can Sonic actually drown in this game? But I already know that he, did, he can't he drown. There's no underwater physics in this game at all. I thought it was quite interesting, though, because even in 3D sections, you know, um, during a Seaside Hill in Sonic Generations, if you went, like, into the water so much so that you didn't actually fall off and die, Sonic would, in fact, you know, drown to death and the music would start playing, it was really cool. I really should have just cut this out. <laughs> Fuck me. Wouldn't it be cool if I also sped up my voice at some point? Because I can totally do that. I'm not going to do it now because that would make require some dodgy editing but because <laughs> I'm lazy and yeah but now we're the werehog and I find one sun medal and then I think fuck it let's just get out of here I explore the over I explore the uh, this place for about two seconds realize I can't do anything by the way Shamar hi aunt by the way Shamar's temple is awful by the way, it's one of my least favourites in the game. And okay, we're off to the next part. See you there.